Prom, 2011. Did you go to prom? No. Considering I'm a sophomore, I can't unless if I have a junior or senior date. Therefore, I did not go. Okay. Question two. Would you ever go to prom? Duh. Who wouldn't? I mean, besides, you know, all those loners that don't like to be bothered. Question three. Did you have a dress picked out? Yes. I did. It's purple. I don't have it with me, though, because I didn't go to prom, therefore I didn't need it. So. Question four. Did anyone ask you to prom? Nope. Didn't get asked. Maybe I'm just not that special. Okay. Question five. What did you do instead of going to prom? Let's see. Friday, I came here, worked on my project for American government. Then yesterday, my grandma and I went to the mall. Got this bracelet from Hot Topic. It says, talk, to, talk nerdy to me. Um, then after we got back from the mall, I worked on my presentation the rest of the day. Question six. Are you sad that you didn't get to go to prom? Mm, no, not really. It was kind of suckish at first, but no, not really sad. Are you going to prom next year? Mm, yeah. Yeah, next year's going to be my junior year, so, you know, why wouldn't I go? I, I mean, I think I deserve to go, but... Who knows? Question 8. Would you ever go to prom by yourself? Yeah, I would. Especially if I couldn't find a date. Oh, drop that. Okay, question nine. Is prom important to you? Mm, I'm not sure yet. I haven't figured that question out yet. I mean, don't get me wrong. Prom sounds like so much fun, but I'm just not quite sure if it's really important or not. Question 10. How much does prom cost? It really honestly depends on the school. Like, prom tickets at my school were sold for 25 bucks. Seniors got to go for free. Um, and then you have to, you know, rent a tux. Uh, there's always gas money involved. Gotta get a dress, gotta, well, some girls do their nails for prom, some, and some girls go tanning for prom, so, so do some guys, so it really depends, but my guess is anywhere from a hundred to a hundred fifty, and that's just without the tux <laughs> included because Texas run anywhere from 100 to 200 that I know of. So, yeah. But, yeah, usually the prom tickets are pretty cheap. It really depends on the school, though. Okay, question 11. Do you have someone special to go with to prom next year? Mm, not right now. But I'm pretty sure I will have someone. Hopefully. You never know. I may not. Question 12. Do you plan on going to... Going out to eat before prom next year? 
Um, hopefully we have the money too. But if we don't, that's just gonna suck. Guess we're just gonna have to have dinner at home and then meet each other somewhere. Question 13. Where would you go out to eat before prom? Quite honestly, I like to... Well, I realize that prom's like a romantic type deal or whatever. And I realize that a lot of people like go to expensive places like Applebee's, uh, te Texas Steakhouse, Longhorn, and Olive Garden and places like that. But quite honestly, I'd just be happy going to McDonald's. Question 14. Do you get your nails done? Did you get your nails done for prom? People are very observant. I did get my nails done, but it's not for prom. It's because I wanted them done. I was sick of my ugly stubby nails, so I got acrylic ones that are really amazing. So. Question 15. Are there pictures at prom? Um, I think so, but I'm not quite sure. Considering I didn't go this year, I don't know. Question 16. Does it aggravate you knowing all your friends went to prom and you didn't? That one's kind of mean. That's a mean question. I don't like that question. But it did aggravate me, actually, because they were like, Oh my god, I'm going to prom with so-and-so. I'm like, cool, happy for you. They're like, who are you going with? I'm like, do I have to go? They're like, everybody's going. I'm like, your point? I don't know. Kind of lonely. People, my friends now officially think I'm a loser, or not loser, but a loner. How did that come out? <laughs> Wouldn't doubt it if they thought I was a loser, though. It's okay. I don't care. It's not like I have much friends left, anyways. Okay. Question 17. Why is prom such a big deal? Quite honestly, I don't know. I don't know why it's a big deal for juniors. I guess it's their, holy crap, I'm going to be a senior and that's going to be my last year of school. You know, party type thing. And s sophomores are just, you know, so low on the food chain that if a senior or a junior asks you to prom, you're bound to say yes. Because, you know, that's like the ultimate level of cool tea cool tea I guess <laughs> it's not even a word but I just made it a word but um in seniors it's like they're you're graduating get the hell out of here party so yeah I think that's why it's such a big deal question 18 are you excited about going to prom next year it's a little too soon to tell. I'm not quite sure. I mean, that's like a whole year away. Question 19. Do you think your parents will let you go to prom next year? Honestly, I don't know. I know my grandma and grandpa will want me to go to prom next year. But honestly, I don't know about mom and dad. I mean, my older brother is a senior and he's going to be graduating on Friday. He won't have to come to school anymore. Yay! You don't have to deal with him. But, you know, they were, you know, asking him if he was going to prom and he's like, no. I'm like, and they were like, why? And he's like, because it's stupid. I so wanted to slap him. Prom's not stupid. So. I don't know. My parents wanted him to go. I don't know how they'll feel about me going 
because apparently I'm the troublemaker of the family. Question 20. What's the best way to ask someone to go to prom with you? There's a lot of different ways. I mean, you can always, you know, write them a note and give it to them or put it in, the, in their locker. Write, write prom on a one of these cards with a question mark and who it's from and stick it on that locker. Um, get the whole football team and crowd to, you know, ask the girl to go to prom with you while you're standing down in the center of the field. Um, just simply ask her face to face. Take her to McDonald's and, you know, when she's in the bathroom, you know, spell out, will you, will you go to prom with me with french fries? That, that, that would be, uh, I, I guess that'd be kind of corny, but I think, I think that'd be kind of creative and cool. I'd definitely go if somebody did that with me, so, yeah. I don't know, maybe I'm just a weirdo like that. Let's see. What's that? That was all the questions. See? No more questions left. So, yeah. It probably t took about three minutes to do that. Um, but, prom 2011. Apparently a night to remember, according to one of my friends. The theme was um, old English, uh, you know, like Renaissance type stuff, medieval stuff. So, yeah. Um, but, yeah. Prom. Very good side of it. You have fun. Bad side of it. I don't think there is a bad side to prom. Except for the fact you can get pregnant if you aren't careful. So. And no, I don't mean just by dancing. I mean like, because people have like, gone to prom and, you know, after prom, before the after prom party, they went to a hotel or something and got it on and then the girl ends up pregnant, guy ends up leaving her, yada da da da. That is a bad side to prom. So yeah, this has been prom twenty eleven. Hope you had fun listening to me jabber on about prom. So there you go. Later.